One evening, Xiaoying was having dinner with her elementary school-aged son and daughter when they heard a shocking news story on TV. Oh my, Xiaoying exclaimed, catching her children's attention. What happened, mom? her daughter asked. Xiaoying explained, a worker at a black tea shop did something very wrong. She was upset because a customer ordered a drink just before closing time. What did she do? her son asked, curious. She, she spit in her hand and used it to grab ingredients for the drink, Xiaoing said, frowning. Both children gasped. That's gross, they said together. It gets worse, Xiaoing continued. There's more to the story. One of her co-workers filmed her doing this and posted the video online. On the internet, her son asked, shocked. But won't everyone see it? Exactly, Xiaoing said. The co-worker even added a caption to the video, saying the customer was lucky to get a drink made that way. They thought it was funny, but it's actually very serious. But why would they do that? Her daughter asked, looking confused. Xiaoing saw this as a chance to teach an important lesson. Sometimes, people do silly or mean things when they're frustrated. But that's never the right way to act, especially at work. She went on to explain how the Black Tea headquarters had to close that shop and might even take legal action against the workers. You see, Xiaoing said, no matter what job you have, it's important to do your best and be professional. Always act in a way that you can be proud of. Her son nodded. Like when I help clean up after art class, even if I'm tired? Exactly, Xiaoing smiled. That's showing good work ethic. What is work ethic? Her daughter asked. Work ethic means doing your job well and honestly, even when it's hard or you don't feel like doing it, Xiaoing explained. She continued, those workers thought they were being funny, but now they could be in big trouble. It's never worth it to do something wrong just for a laugh or because you're annoyed. The children listened thoughtfully. Remember, Xiaoing concluded, whatever job you do in the future, always do it in a way that makes you and others proud. Treat customers and co-workers with respect, even when it's challenging. As they finished their meal, Xiaoing felt grateful for this chance to teach her children about responsibility and integrity in the workplace. The story of the black tea shop incident had shown them that actions have consequences, and that maintaining professionalism and respect in any job is crucial. Xiaoing hoped her children would carry this lesson with them as they grew, understanding that true success comes not just from what you do, but how you do it with honesty, effort, and consideration for others. Dan Zhu exclaim, Yin Shi Jing, Hai Pa, Xi Yue Deng, Hu Han, Jing Jiao. Verb to say or shout something suddenly because of surprise, fear, pleasure, etc. Black tea, Xi Fang Ren Chang He de Hong Cha, noun dark colored tea of the type usually drunk in the West. Upset, Shi Xing Fan Yi Luan, Shi Sheng Qi. Adjective worried, unhappy, or angry. Spit. Tuo tu yu zhi tuo ye. Verb to force out the contents of the mouth, especially saliva. Ingredient. Shi pin de cheng fen. Cai liao. Noun. A food that is used with other foods in the preparation of a particular dish. Caption. Biao ti zi mu zhao pian suo ming. Noun. A short piece of text under a picture in a book or article that describes the picture or explains what the people in it are doing or saying. Headquarters. Songbu. Noun. The main offices of an organization such as the army, the police, or a business company. Work ethic. Zhiyedaode. Noun. The belief that work is morally good. Professionalism. Zhuanye Jingsen. Noun. The combination of all the qualities that are connected with trained and skilled people.